What's up you guys, it's Jose Zaniga from Teaching Men's Fashion and for today's video, we're gonna be going over six essentials, accessories that no stylish man should ever leave behind in his house. Well, I guess we could say no man, because this really applies to almost every guy in my personal opinion. These are six things that I always carry around, whether they're in my car or on me personally, that I find give me a lot of functionality, help me look better, and also look incredibly stylish. So the first accessory that you should always carry, you might be a little bit surprised about this one, but it's hats. That's right. I don't mean to actually carry this with you every day, but have at least one in your car and one maybe in your backpack or at home. I've been really digging these dad hats lately. They're very affordable. You can find them everywhere. And I like them because they're simple and they go with almost every outfit. But here comes the why. You need one of these, at least me personally, my hair, it has a mind of its own. And depending on the day and if it's not feeling right, it can get frizzy, out of control, and I just look like a mess. So if you want to hide some of that, and again, look more stylish, pop out one of these trending dad hats, put it on, and it'll look like you intentionally went for a casual look. Number two accessory that no man should leave behind is sunglasses, no Advil. Again, I mean, they made a whole song about this, so you can see where I'm going with this. Most of us maybe had a rough night, or we're just having a bad day. Sunglasses will be your lifesaver. Kind of goes with the first tip that I talked about. This is an accessory, again, that I carry every single day. This is my uh, Ray-Ban pair. It's de designated in my car. I always leave it in my car. If I'm having, you know, maybe I have some really dark eye circles or heavy bags under my eyes, I can pop these out instantly make myself look better and hide my imperfection. In the same way, it's just a functional item to have. Not only does it protect you against the sun, it could be that you also just need reading glasses. Now, these glasses that you're seeing right now, you can get from Glasses USA. I've talked about them before, and in my personal opinion, it's probably one of the best places to find frames for your face shape. They have a try-on mirror that you can try different frames, see what suits you best and what structures your face better. And also their selection is endless. Like I said, you can get big name brands in Glass USA like Ray-Ban and all that stuff, but really, I recommend their in-house brand. I mean, they have so many styles that honestly, it's incredible. And not only that, their in-house brand starts at around $40, $50. And not only are they super stylish frames, they're very well made. I have about like eight different pairs from Glasses USA because when you go on their website, I'm gonna have them linked below, you guys can check them out. You're probably gonna spend a good hour trying to decide which pair to get because they have so many different styles there. Now, since they are our sponsor, they hooked you guys up so great with a discount code. I'm gonna have it linked below. Definitely check out their website if you don't have some glasses plus use that discount code, you're gonna get a great deal on your first pair. But not only that, it's gonna be a great accessory to carry every day. Like I said, either you had a rough night, you're just not feeling yourself, you have bags under your eyes, pulling out a pair of frames that suits your face can instantly hide your imperfections and just elevate your mood, make you feel more attractive and look sexier. Third accessory that no man should leave behind is a pen and I have one for almost every style but the utility factor of them is essential whether you're gonna be writing a check writing down your phone number giving somebody an address there's always gonna be a need for you to have a pen and it looks really awesome when you can pull out your own pen instead of you shuffling around being like oh wait I don't have anything to write with in my opinion not only is that a stylish move being able to pull out your only pen you kind of impress the other individual and if you're in a business setting that's exactly what you want to be doing all right number four here we go i'm gonna have a little bit of whiplash but you guys know where i'm going with this a pocket knife i personally carry a pocket knife because i find a lot of utility on it i open a lot of packages every day and a pocket knife facilitates that. Not only that, you never know what could happen. Now, I always get that question every time I talk about how I carry a pocket knife, I always get, why do you need that? Why do you need that? But like I showed in my last vlog, one of you guys, one of you viewers actually took that tip and started carrying a, a pocket knife that also had a, a seatbelt cutter and a glass breaker. Long story short, he was in an accident, it jammed his door, and his seatbelt was locked, he couldn't get out. He wasn't in any real danger, he just couldn't get out, so he took it out, cut the seatbelt, broke the window, and was able to get out the car. It could have been much more serious, thank God it wasn't, but that's just a small example of so many unexpected circumstances where you could use a sharp object. Number five is a wallet. Of course, no man can leave the house without a wallet, and you have a couple options when it comes to wallets, but I always, always, always will recommend you guys to pick up a slim wallet. 
something that's gonna force you to reduce your carry and not carry this huge bulky thing that's gonna add awkward bulges to your outfit. Not only that, it looks way sleeker and more stylish when you can pull out a nice wallet. This one that you see here is very simple, very minimal, but super functional. I carry what I need and when I slip it into my pocket, it essentially disappears. And finally, the last accessory that I cannot leave the house with, and that's my watch. When I don't have something on my wrist, it gets to the point that I do feel naked, like I feel awkward. And I've talked about the benefits of a watch before, so I won't divulge too much into it, but you, as you guys know, when it comes to being stylish, it, it's the little things that make a difference. And in today's day and age, a lot of men don't take advantage to the few pieces of jewelry that we can actually wear. All right, boys, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you can't leave the house with. And if you like this video, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, don't forget to check out Glasses USA. I'm going to have it linked below. They have a huge selection and they gave us a great deal, guys. So that's it for me in today's video. See you next time.